you created the tech typesetting system and released it as open source. Just on that little aspect, why did you release it as open source? What is your vision for open source? Okay, well, that the word open source didn't exist at that time, but we, but I, I didn't want proprietary rights over it uh, because I saw how proprietary rights were holding th things back. In the late 50s, people at IBM developed the language called Fortran. They could have kept it proprietary. They could have said only IBM can use this language. Everybody else has to but but they didn't. They said anybody who can write who can translate Fortran in, in, into the into the language of their machines uh, is allowed to make, make Fortran compilers too. Um, on the other hand, in the typography industry, I had seen a, a, a lot of languages that were developed for composing pages, mm -hmm. and each manufacturer had his own language for composing pages. And that was holding everything back because people w w were tied to a particular manufacturer and, and then a new equipment is invented a year later, but printing printing machines, they have to expect to amortize the cost over 20, 30 years. So you didn't want that for tech? I didn't need the income. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. I, I, already, I, I already had, uh, a, a good job, and, and you know, I, I, my, my books were. Uh, people were buying enough books that I that that it would bring me plenty of supplemental income for everything my kids needed for education, whatever. So there was no reason for me to try to maximize income any further. Mm -hmm. Income is sort of a threshold function. If you don't have, if you don't have enough, you, you, you're starving. Mm -hmm. But if, if if you get over the threshold, then you start thinking about philanthropy or else, or or, or trying to take it with you. But uh, <laughs> uh, but anyway, there's a. I had I, I, my income was over the threshold, so, mm -hmm. so so I I didn't need to keep it, and so I specifically could see the advantage of of. Of making it open for everybody. Do you think uh, most software should be open? So I think that uh, people should charge for non-trivial software, but not for trivial software. Yeah, you give an example of, I think, Adobe Photoshop versus GIMP on Linux, as Photoshop right. has value. Which So it's definitely worth paying, paying for all the stuff. I mean, and, and I mean, well, they keep adding, uh, adding stuff that that my wife and I don't care about, but <laughs> somebody obviously does. But I mean, but they have built in a, a fantastic uh, uh, undo feature, for example, in Photoshop, where where you 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 can go through a, a sequence of a thousand complicated steps on graphics, and it can take you back anywhere in that sequence. Yeah. Has a uh, long history with too. really beautiful algorithms. I mean, the, yeah, it's it's. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't think about what algorithm. It must be some kind of efficient representation. It's really, yeah, no. I mean, there, there's a, a lot of really subtle Nobel Prize class like, <laughs> creation of intellectual property in in in, in there, um, and uh, and w w with patents, uh, you get a limited time to. Uh, I mean, eventually, the idea of patents is that you publish so that it's not secret, it's not a trade secret. That said, you, you've said that I currently use Ubuntu Linux on a standalone laptop. It has no internet connection. I occasionally yeah. carry flash memory drives between the machine and the Macs that I use for network surfing and graphics, but I trust my family jewels only to Linux. Why do you love Linux? The version of Linux that I use is stable. I, 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 <laughs> uh, actually, I, I, I'm going to have to upgrade one of these days. But to a newer version of Ubuntu. Yeah, I, I'll stick with Ubuntu. But but uh, right now I'm running something that doesn't support a, a lot of the new software. It, it, the last stable, I, I don't remember the no, number, but 
like 14. Anyway, it's, it's, it's quite, and I'm going to get a new computer. Um, I'm, I, I'm getting new um, solid state memory instead of, instead of a hard disk. Yeah, the basics. 